Hey guys, welcome to Inferno Watch. Today I'll be teaching you how to denoise objects in Blender really easily and really quickly. So, first you might have heard uh, all you have to do is up this, the sample count for the render, which, yes, you can do that, and that will decrease the noise in your images or your, your videos or whatever, but that will also substantially increase the render time. So, I will teach you how to denoise things without increasing your render time that much. So first with the default amount of samples and this this glass cube here this is what it looks like. So the final render here has quite a bit of noise in it. Um, the, it would look the same with metallic objects as well. It would have a lot of noise everywhere and it will just uh, it would just not look good. So of course um, changing the sample count to a higher one like say 250 and rendering this out would decrease the noise quite a bit but not all that much so as you can see here it did you know, fix it fix it quite a bit it got rid of a lot of noise but there's still quite a bit here so first what you would need to do is go to compositing check this use nodes separate these two here go over to this tab here the uh, the view layers properties check this this that says denoising data right here check it as you can see right here a whole lot of extra options popped up here shift a add a denoise node add that in the middle here and connect your denoising normal to the normal the denoising albedo to the albedo here and that's all you have to do for that so just doing that has substantially fixed uh, the noise uh, and reduced it quite a bit so with the normal default sample count and that denoising trick there here's what it would look like so already you can tell that there's not a whole lot of noise it got rid of most of it but uh, there's a little bit of blotchiness um, but definitely zero noise so with increasing the sample count to something like 250 or higher of course you can go a lot higher and get better results but um, I like to use 250 you go to 250 and the denoising trick here here's what it looks like it just looks a lot better a lot cleaner no noise whatsoever in the video. I don't know how to end the video. Let's see, what do I say normally? Thank you guys for watching. See you in the next video. Make sure to subscribe if you haven't. <laughs> Gotta go on the other screen. Mm -hmm. Make sure to script. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> Make sure to subscribe, hit that like button, and uh, I'll see you in the next video. <laughs> I don't know. Drop a comment how well this works for you. <laughs> nice beep. Thanks for watching this video. Subscribe if you haven't. Like the video if you like it. See you in the next one.